Hey guys, so this weekend I'm gonna do a weekend in my life. So today is Friday and it's currently 9.17 and Paul got home from work and then he pretty much left right away. He's going golfing with a friend and then tonight he's hanging out with his friends. So it's just gonna be me and Luella all day today probably, but um, we are going to go to the mall so I can get something from Ulta for their 21 days of beauty. It's half off. So we're gonna go to the mall and then stop at Target to pick up a couple of grocery things. So that's the plan for today. All right, we just got back from Target and the mall. And so at Target, um, kids books were buy two get one free. And so there's some cute Eastery spring ones. So I got this baby animals one that's the touch and feel. The story of Easter and happy Easter mouse. So I thought those looked cute. And then these are two for $6. So um, I've been craving like sweet things at night. So peanut M&Ms, regular M&Ms. And then I saw this on sale in the clearance and it's six to nine months. So it'll be perfect for the fall for her. And it was $2.49 for that. And then this one was $7.99 and I got it in the 12 month size. So it'll be for Easter next year, this little snuggle bunny one. So I thought those were cute. This, I go through these like water and I had um, like a 10% off like nursing supplies. So I got 100 nursing pads, this power dissolver or power wash. I've heard that's really good for cleaning. I kind of want to try it in my shower. Um, so I got that. And these guys were each $5, but this one is missing one egg. So I got it um, for $4.50 instead of $5. So, I mean, I told her they were the last two and she's like, she, well, she noticed that there was missing an egg and I was like, oh no, that's fine. And it was the last two. And she offered to give me 10% off. So this one was only $4.50 this one was $5 and I thought they were adorable. This Luella has the baby acne and um, it's starting to be really dry um, because we are washing it every night and I don't have a scentless lotion for it so I got this and it's got very few ingredients so I liked that too compared to like other things on the market. And then some more soap for Paul and I. Then I went to Ulta, that was the only place I went in the mall. I got this Gimme Brow, I'm shade three. That was half off today with their 21 Days of Beauty. And then I got a backup of my um, foundation. This is a foundation I wear pretty much every single day. And I'm almost out of it in my color. And then I have one that's darker too so that as I get darker in the summer I can mix. And then I got this sample of this Clinique Moisture Surge. I'll probably be allergic to it, but yeah, that's what I got from the mall, and I'm gonna have some soup for lunch. <laughs> oh no, you're gonna be grumpy when we do it. Thank you. <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs> You're not doing it anymore, are you? No, you're not. You're not doing it anymore. Where's the smile? Oh, you're getting grumpy now. Hey guys, so it is currently 5.15. We um, just snuggled after lunch. She took a nap. We hung out on the deck for a while um, in the sun. It was beautiful. And then Paul got home around 2.40, I believe. And we hung out for a while. I mean, he napped for a while. And at like 4.30 or so, he left to go hang out with his friends again. So he is going to be there all night and it's gonna be me and Luella. I just filmed my induction experience video. So if you guys haven't seen that, go watch it now. I'm planning on uploading that first. Um, I have to edit right now, I have to edit my 24 hours with the newborn video and then, um, my induction experience will probably be the next video after that. So if you guys haven't seen those videos, make sure you go watch those. Right now, Little Miss just woke up right at the end of, as I was filming, so that was perfect that I got to film most of the video without a squirmy baby. And now she's falling asleep again, but she pooped while I was filming. So I am going to change her diaper and then I will probably start editing my newborn um, like 24 hours with a newborn video and then if I have time I'll probably also edit my induction experience video hey guys so I just fed little miss 
and now we're snuggling i just burped her a bit and yeah she has had really good head control ever since she's been born like she's very very strong so she moves wherever she wants to be basically um so we're just hanging out here i'll probably heat up some dinner actually um I might have that leftover pasta again. Hey guys, so I uploaded the, or I edited the 24 hours with the newborn video and I'm uploading it right now. I also edited my induction video. Um, so those will be the next two videos going up and then this one will be after that. But yeah, so I edited that. It's currently eight o'clock and I'm probably gonna wake Luella up here and keep her awake until we go to bed so i typically wake her up around eight and then keep her up until we go to bed around 10 so that has been my routine the last couple of nights but again you'll see more of that in an upcoming video of newborn nighttime routine where i'll go more in depth on everything that we do luella it's time to wake up <laughs> Luella. It's time to wake up, little miss. It's funny because sometimes newborns wake so easily, except when you're trying to wake them up. Luella. Well, wish me luck, my cutie boys. And we're watching Chris Lee Knows Best. I think I'm almost caught up. So I'm upset about that. But now I gotta wake up this sleeping beauty. Hey guys. So it is currently about 7.45 on Saturday morning. Last night Luella and I went to bed. Um, she was asleep by 10.30. And Paul got home around like just before 3 o'clock. And Luella woke up at about 6.30. She started making some noises. So we got up around 6.30. We have been snuggling on the couch. I fed her, changed her, all that good stuff. I got dressed. I might get ready later. It is a rainy day out already, so that's kind of annoying. But Paul has off today and tomorrow, so that's exciting. I don't know what our plans are for today. I'll let him sleep for a while, but yeah, it's currently 7.45. I've got dishes in the dishwasher to put away. Got some crazy boys. <laughs> but I'll probably unload the dishwasher here so that's the plan for now Hey guys, so Luella fell asleep, so I went ahead and got ready. I did a little bit different of a look today. So that is what I did today. So far, it is currently about 9.15. It is very dreary outside, nice and rainy. Oh, and at some point today, we have to leave the house and go pick up Paul's truck. So one of his friend's um, families owns a cabin that's like 20 minutes from here. Not even, I don't think. Um, and so that's where he and his friends hung out and played poker and stuff last night. So then um, his friend's wife, who is my friend also, um, she ended up driving Paul home last night. We have to go pick up his truck at some point and I don't know, maybe we'll do something else too, I don't know. But I'm gonna let the pups out into the rain and I need to go get a rag for their paws when they come inside. Bye Fenster, Frank. So I ended up pumping since Luella's still sleeping. It's about 9.40 and got a snuggly little Frankster boy as always. Um, and I got about seven ounces all together. So um, sometimes I get like seven, sometimes I get like eight plus. Um, and then like yesterday since I wasn't able to pump for as long as I normally do, I usually do about 10 to 12 minutes. And then yesterday since she woke up, I was not able to, but yeah. That's what I'm gonna do 
So yeah, that's about how much I pump at a time. I actually only um, pump about once a day and I've only pumped twice a day once and that was a day, that was last Tuesday, which if you watched my, um, I think it was like a, I called it like a couple days in my life video, but it's the video I uploaded before the um, 24 hours with the newborn video. But in that video, I shared that Luella had her first bottle and she took it really well. So then my mom told me to go get a pedicure um, and she ended up feeding her a couple bottles that day. And so because of that, I had to pump twice that day. So yeah, um, I can show you my milk stash actually quickly. I'll go out and show you that in our freezer. Okay, so we have this outdoor freezer and <laughs> this is currently my milk stash. Luella will be six weeks old tomorrow and I have a ton of milk. Um, these bags hold technically five ounces, but I can get six ounces in them. So yeah, that's my milk stash. I only have that much more room in the doors to fill. So I don't know what I'm going to do after that because that's a disaster. I'm trying to uh, work through a lot of the stuff that we have in the freezer too. Yeah, I'm trying to work through a lot of the stuff that we have in the freezer and like going through the stuff that we have in this freezer, really trying to eat up a lot of the food. But yeah, I'm trying to make sure we clean out our freezer a bit. So yeah, that is my milk stash. I'm very happy with how much I have. Um, depending, so I go back to work in about six weeks, so I'm about halfway over with my leave. And depending on how much she's eating at that point and how much milk I have, I am considering donating milk. So I need to look into organizations that I can do that through in our area. But I have so much milk, like I probably have over 300 ounces in there. Like there's a lot of milk in there, but uh, I don't think I'll be needing as much as I have but I definitely want to donate it so it doesn't go to waste and that somebody else can use it then too, so. Hey guys, we just finished at Menards. I was driving and we got some stuff for the backyard and for the pond. Now we got the pups and the baby in tow and we are gonna head home. And yeah, it's still a rainy, dreary day out, but oh well, it's not too dark supposed to rain all day. Hey guys, so we've been home for a little while now and um, I fed Luella and she fell asleep. Now we're just hanging out. My mom will be here in like five or so minutes and Paul went and picked us some Mexican food up from our little, one of our two whole restaurants in our town. Um, so we're gonna have that for dinner once my mom gets here. Hey guys, so today is actually Monday and um, I didn't really vlog yesterday. Uh, we just hung out with some of my family. We drove to go visit them and went to a brewery. <clears throat> and then we also went to Sam's Club in the town that they live in and we ended up getting a new fridge for out in the garage. So we've got a stand-up freezer out there. We're pretty into drinking like craft beers and trying different ones and stuff. Like I got that from my dad and my dad shared that with Paul also. So it's kind of a fun thing, but we ended up getting a fridge for out in the garage. Yeah, we got a new fridge for out in the garage. My mom's still here. She's out on a run with Frankie. Um, last night was Luella's six night in a row sleeping through the night <clears throat> she's talking a lot right now on the couch she's right here I think she might be trying to poop but um
Mm -hmm. It's the most precious thing in the whole world. Um, but today I have my six week appointment with my midwife who uh, delivered Miss Luella. So, yeah. We're gonna go to that. Yeah. We're gonna go to Mama's doctor's appointment. Yeah. 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 Hey guys, so it's just me hopping on to end this video. So I hope you guys enjoyed and look forward to the next one, which will probably be just like a days in my life. I hope you guys enjoyed the video.